Now, the problem with that is, did I just spook everything in this lake? I hope not. Because this is a major hot spot for Black Buck. <gasps> What's that? What's that axis steer? Look at the estimate on that. Wait, the estimate on that fort. That's a five, dude. That's a five. I don't want to spot it yet because I want to build up suspense because I'm that much of a dick. But that, that's got to be a five. Piebald red deer out there. Why can't you be a stag though? Piebald red deer just chilling. Like it's no big deal. I'm going to have to shoot you. I don't know if you know this. I don't know if you know this. But I'm going to have to shoot you with my fancy little M1 here. Bang! Spined it. Man, did that thing ever take a long time to die considering it got shot in the spine? Yo, no. No way. Albino buck. That's an albino. 100%. You gotta be kidding me. That is for sure an albino buck. 1,000, 100,000 percent. Should we try to take that down with the crossbow too? I feel like we might as well. Decent buck too. Not bad. I feel like all of my albino mule deer all kind of look the same. They're all like, you know, that size. Mid-sized buck. Let's see if we can, uh, see if we can get over there and line up a good shot with the crossbow. I wouldn't mind doing that. We got a good wind. 160 out. That's a nice one like it not bad not huge but a nice little rack on him all right we're gonna have to slow down here creep on in hopefully this won't get too dicey out here but I'm gonna call them up over this hill just I'm gonna go prone right up here I'm thinking I'm thinking going franken prone right here like so come on there they are there they are uh, which way are they gonna go I was hoping they would come right down towards me, but I think they might go that way. Probably gonna have to do this from 50. Here we go. It's right there. Broadside. Got him. Got the lung. There we go. Happened faster than I thought it was going to happen. But we got him. I mean, he pretty much <laughs> came out and posed for us. I didn't think that was going to happen like that. He's like, here I am. Perfectly broadside right in front of you. Am I close enough? Ow. Sweet! Oh, absolutely perfect shot. Right above the shoulder. Just about through the heart, too. Both lungs. I'm surprised he didn't go straight down from that shot. Oh, there is a three in there. Kidding me? Of course there is. Oh, it's not the piebald, though. <sighs> there is a piebald and a three. Ah, oh, that's too bad. Uh, but we should shoot that pie ball too, because you never know. It is a, a diamond potential, technically. But we got a diamond, and we do... Uh, I don't what, what is with this flock? Look, there's more. Dude, are you serious? Are you serious? There's an absolute massive flock of chickens out here. 
in Parquet of the Fernandos. But one ten out. Let's see if I can get that and the piebald. Let's see if we can do it here. Right in the butt. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, that's gonna be tough, isn't it? Oh, come on. Get up there. Oh, that's a tough shot, man. I don't like it. Oh, wow, I actually hit it. Okay. All right, sure. Now, the problem with that is, did I just spook everything in this lake? I hope not. Because this is a major hot spot for Black Buck. <gasps> What's that? What's that axis steer? Look at the estimate on that. Wait, the estimate on that fort. That's a five, dude. That's a five. I don't want to spot it yet because I want to build up suspense because I'm that much of a dick. But that, that's got to be a five. That's a five. Oh, look at that thing. It is a five. <laughs> so that, oh man, dude, that's the first legit level five true X axis that I've seen. I haven't seen one since they fixed them. And I don't have a, a diamond true rack access, so that might be my first one. But that's a, pot a diamond potential estimate too. Although I don't think that's a diamond. It doesn't look big enough. Either it doesn't look big enough, or this one's just so big that it's making it look like it's not big enough. But I do believe that one's a diamond. If I remember correctly, that's a diamond rack. Like, a thousand percent. Also, it's got wonky brow tines. Or wait, maybe not. Anyway, stop talking and play the game, KC. Hey, man. <laughs> it's gonna be in some brush over there. Probably some thick brush. All right, let's creep down here. That's the piebald. Oh, and there's the diamond right there. So how cool would it be? How cool would it be if this piebald's a diamond too? Okay, so piebald first. Piebald's a gold, 4.4. We got a diamond cinnamon teal, so cool. We got a piebald cinnamon teal at this lake. We got a diamond cinnamon teal at this lake, 4.6. I'm gonna taxi it. And then now, as if that wasn't fun enough, we've got a level five axis steer. Perfect win. The only thing is, can we get a line of sight? And can we get him broadside? Or at least close to broadside. We've got a perfect win. So that's, that's not an issue. Just got to get a good line of sight and hopefully have him broadside. I don't think I'm going to worry too much about that four. We'll take it We'll take it down eventually for a respawn. But I just want that five. I'm super confident that five is a diamond. This is an exciting moment for me. I'm going to try to take it down with the crossbow. He's about 90 out. I've got him marked. Ooh, there's that big four. He's in a good spot. Yeah, he's in a real good spot. But he's not who we're after. And he's not big enough for diamond. I can I can tell just by looking at him. But his estimate is insane. Somewhere at the bottom of that estimate. That's our boy right there. That's our boy right there. He's a big boy. I think he makes diamond. What do you guys think? It's been a while since I've seen one. I haven't seen one since they were broken. But if I'm remembering correctly, I think that one's a diamond. I don't mind that angle. Gotta keep in mind the wind is pushing a little left. Mm. Like, I've got a line of sight there. I wonder if I just push up from here. He's attentive. Are you kidding? Oh, are they going to do this? <laughs> They're attentive from 70 meters away? Yikes. They're going to pull this, are they? Alright, we'll take it extra slow. We'll take it extra slow. Hopefully, uh, we'll get really lucky and he'll, he'll turn a little bit to his right while we're moving. That would be, that would be awesome. 
because this is going to be a little dicey from this angle. I think he might have even turned a little bit towards me since we've been moving in. Also, I want to keep him spotted because I want to know. I want to make sure he's staying calm. I'm trying to get that spot. There we go. He's calm. He's like, he's front facing now. There he is. He's calm. He's about 30 out. He's about 30 out. The thing is, he's only sticking his head up for like a second. Notice that? He's coming up. Oh, um, yeah, he's going like right back down, man. That's how that's done. That's how that's done. That's how we do it, baby. <laughs> I was watching when he was going up and coming down and trying to like get the feel for the time of it. Because he was only coming up for a couple seconds and then going back down. But I, I, I timed that out perfect. Sat up and he was up and just quickly took the shot. And it worked. And I hope he's a diamond. He's wonky though. Look how wonky he is. I like that he's wonky. I'm just I'm worried that that's gonna affect his score. He's quite a bit bigger on the right than he is on the left. Yikes! I don't know. Yeah, he's bigger on the right, a lot bigger. He's a diamond, two thirty point one. He's oh my gosh! I knew he looked big, man. He's a two thirty point one. <laughs> Dark. Also, he's a dark, which is cool. 73.68 kilos. Jeez. I don't even think I got one that big when they were broken. Absolutely picture-perfect shot. That couldn't have gone better. That's crazy.